just as it seemed the wave of layoffs might be receding. Major corporations like Rolls-Royce, Ford, Stack Overflow, Google, Nokia and Coal India have stirred the job market with large-scale workforce reductions, leaving thousands of employees affected. While motivations behind these actions differ, with some firms aiming to cut costs, others are restructuring for future growth. However, what's evident is that the era of mass layoffs is back. This resurgence has placed employees in a difficult spot, forcing them to decide between holding on to their current jobs and venturing into the uncertain job market. It's a situation causing anxiety and uncertainty among the workforce. Among the notable companies making layoffs are industry leaders like LinkedIn, Nokia, KPMG, Rolls-Royce, Stack Overflow, Google and Coal India. These announcements signal a challenging and turbulent period ahead for the workforce as they wrestle with tough choices and emotional turmoil linked to potential job loss. Google recently made workforce reductions in its news division, affecting around 40 to 45 positions. While acknowledging the layoffs, Google emphasized its commitment to a vibrant information ecosystem and pledged support to affected employees in their transition to new opportunities. LinkedIn, part of Microsoft, is letting go of approximately 668 employees within its engineering, product, talent and finance divisions in response to prolonged sluggish revenue growth. KPMG, the accounting firm, is considering cutting about 100 positions in its UK deal advisory business due to reduced client demand. This move aligns with the firm's goal to match its workforce with current and expected market conditions. Rolls-Royce, the British engineering company, is planning a significant workforce reduction of around 2,500 employees, about 6% of its total workforce. The move is a part of a broader cost-cutting initiative led by Rolls-Royce's new CEO, aimed at creating a more efficient and streamlined organization. The unbreakable Nokia has also unveiled plans to trim its workforce and boost operational efficiency, aiming for a reduction from its current 86,000 employees to 72,000 to 77,000. The decision follows a significant decline in third quarter earnings with net sales dropping by 20% to 4.98 billion euros and profit plummeting by 69% to 133 million euros year on year. Nokia's president and CEO Pekka Lundmark emphasized the necessity of resetting the cost base to adapt a market uncertainty while safeguarding long-term profitability and competitiveness. The company intends to achieve 400 million euros of in-year savings in 2024 and an additional 300 million euros in 2025 all while maintaining its long-term operating margin target of at least 14% by 2026. Stack Overflow, a popular developer community website, has also made layoffs affecting approximately 28% of its workforce. The move comes as a response to shifting customer budgets and macroeconomic pressures. While the numbers vary from hundreds to thousands this time, these layoffs reflect the economic challenges faced by various industries and highlight the difficult times many employees might face in the coming year.